on another ride with the fight fans. Joey KO, Mix Marshall Mike, and here we go. We are upset. This reminds me of when Frankie Edgar got robbed twice back to back. You hear the internet going crazy. They don't feel that Max ever lost. And I, I felt he won both fights, in my opinion. One thing for sure that's everlasting other than Usman grabbing Masvidal by the nuts is the fact that Max Holloway got robbed. And trust me, this is not coming from a guy who is just remembering the night of the fight. I rewatched the fight. The night of the fight, I thought Max Holloway won the first three rounds and then Volkanovski won four and five. Rewatching it, it was confirmed to me that Max Holloway won the first round, the second round, and the fourth round. And you can see the copy box stats, copy box, that's boxing. But the, the, the punch stats and the kick stats and the striking stats confirm that those rounds are extremely close. I could have sworn that if you saw the stats, Volkanovski was up by points in the fourth round. But if you watch the round, and this is why watching the fights are important, not just looking at the numbers that a lot of people are doing. If you watch the fight, you realize Max Holloway landed more power, significant strikes. So, them, yeah, so you can say them. more. Leg yes, kicks. but Volkanovski landed a lot of leg kicks. I'm not trying to say I'm a Hawaiian supporter now. I'm an Irishman supporter. I'm, the, I'm a Conor McGregor nut hugger. A Conor sexual, you know, coined by this guy over here. And this guy always find any little opportunity. I had to, guys. I'm to sorry. Okay. I had to. I had to. I just wanted to make it clear I'm not biased towards Max. And this is why I truly believe. I saw it for what I saw. Max Holloway got robbed. You know what? We're going to feature a video because we're going to talk the next episode. We're going to talk about should Conor McGregor fight Miles Vidal. And who the hell would say no? Max landed a beautiful leg kick. Landed a couple overall blows. I felt like he landed the hardest shots. And I'm not the only one that feels this way. Not only is there a bunch of fans all through the internet saying Max got robbed in, in every damn uh, group. Nate Diaz tweeted that he thought Max Holloway got robbed. Yeah, and, and even someone who helped write the rules to actually mm. judge these fights, John McCarthy, actually spoke his mind. Max Holloway got... I want to say robbed. Yeah, you didn't like that term. He got job. The Volkanovski fight was not that hard of a fight to judge. Yeah. Max was tooling him in the beginning of that fight. I'll give Volkanovski coming on in the end. Okay. But there's no way that he won three rounds of that fight. Did not happen. Impossible. Sorry. I don't know what the hell you're looking at. I wrote the rules that you go by for your criteria, and you're not freaking following them. He's an innovator. He's one of the pioneers of MMA, and he helped really uh, put it in writing the rules of MMA. And remember that how young MMA is. I'm older than the UFC. So understand how young this company is and for how far it's come so I remember far. watching UFC 1, 2, 3. I mean, Look I've at seen that. That's amazing. every UFC. I remember when they took it out of TV and, and I couldn't watch it on pay-per-view anymore. I was heartbroken. It was years. I had to watch the UFC on DVD. So you're talking to a real fight fan. And there, I'm going to tell you another thing. There aren't too many robberies in UFC history. But this might be one of the biggest. Uh, I mean, I can't think of any other fight other than Frankie Edgar where I was really shocked and surprised. And Max... I give him his credit because he's taking it like a true G. I must agree with that. You made that point off camera and I totally agree. Max Holloway not only has taken it like a champ, he defended the judges that didn't give him the decision because I believe they were getting death threats. So he came into their defense and I respect that wholeheartedly. He didn't um, complain about the results and I yeah. think that's incredible. I don't feel the referee Most fighters, should die or the judges should die. Wait, but he didn't do the, the Diaz brothers and react like a sore loser. If, if I'm Max... I at least want to slap the shit out of him. You what? Back what? the fuck up. You better back the fuck up out my face, goddammit. I'm from Detroit, Michigan. Don't play with me. That's a slap in the face. Nah, the oh, one you're supposed to slap is yourself. You listen to Dana White. You don't let it go to the judges. Dana White knew Max Holloway won as well. And he's angry as hell. They don't get a chance to market the third fight as one-to-one -one and the rubber match. If the UFC could do 
Tito Ortiz versus Shamrock three times where it wasn't even competitive for a second. Okay, if they could do that fight three times, if Pacquiao and Marquez could fight four times. So, so what you're yes, trying to say is yes. that you're winning for the immediate, immediate rematch. Right away. But wouldn't this right be the away. first time that an immediate rematch will be followed by an immediate rematch? This is the first time you hear companies actually giving uh, people who betted on the fight their refunds. money back. They're wow. giving them refunds. They say, you know what? If you bet it on Max, here's your money back. There were people that thought Volkanovski won and I won them. I thought he did win the first fight. This time, people are saying Max Holloway won. And this yeah. guy was gifted. Did you hear what the Korean zombie said? He said that it's uh, an embarrassment that he's the champion right now. We just saw Daniel Cormier beat Stipe. Stipe comes right back in an immediate rematch after the whole year. We know the dispute, whatever. He comes back and he finishes Daniel Cormier to win the title. Now they're going to have a rubber match. And they could have had another one of those at Featherweight. And you know what I don't respect? Uh, Volkanov, whatever Volkanovsky. Volkanovsky himself said that the judges got it right. That kind of makes me feel like you're full of shit, bro. You should have just At the kept end it real and said, hey, I'm not a judge. It's not my job or something. But for you, for, I hate when I see fighters act like they don't know what the hell people are talking about. These rounds were close. This is exactly how I had it. The third round, very, very close. I believe the stats said Max had more strikes, but I thought Volkanovski landed the better strikes throughout the round, so I gave him the round in a close one. The fourth round comes, the stats say Volkanovski landed more strikes, but I believe Max Holloway landed the more effective strike, so I gave him round four. Round five comes, and I think that's universally renowned as a Volkanovski round. I rounds. had it three rounds to two because I was being nice. This fight was easily four rounds to one. Volkanovski won the fifth and final round. Period. Period. But the first four rounds, you could there make some, an argument that There was that a Max close won. round that you could have gave to him, but he lost this fight, man. Give us your take, man. Who you think really won this fight? Did Max really, truly get robbed? Should they fight a third time? I say yes. Hell oh, yeah. Peace. Oh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and all that good shit. If you don't fucking like, comment, and subscribe, Mix Marshall Dyke here is going to beat the shit out of you. Not me, but he's going to fuck you up. <laughs> We're going to go right back in there, baby. <laughs> all right. I'm upset. <laughs> nah, no, we are upset. <laughs> Genuinely. You know, it is what it is. It is what it is. You know, it is what it is. It is what it is. You know.